Uh, I have some really interesting to share with you guys today. We actually found remote chunk loading in 16. It works in 1.16.2 plus all the way up to 1.16.5. Uh, it does actually work in the snapshot versions as well. So expect this to be a way to remote chunk load in 17 potentially as well. If they don't change how the mechanics work. So remote chunk loading in 16 is very simple. It's just literally walking through a portal and it working. Uh, so let me explain what's going on. So here I have a portal in the overworld at 10k, 10k. So I'm going to teleport to the same location as I am now into the nether. So I'm going to teleport here. Here I have a minecart uh, and a command block in it that tells me it's loading 10k, 10k in the nether. And I'm also going to have this guy go off here, which means if it's entity processing, uh, this uh, dispenser should go off and then start loading uh, the nether portal at 80k, 80k. So that means we're entity processing 10 times our, or excuse me, 8 times our coordinates. So let's go ahead and uh, let's go back to the original location we were originally starting this video at. And we're just going to wait the 10 seconds until the coordinates uh, that are loaded to die down. And for this demonstration, it all requires your ping and TPS to server. Now, since I'm doing this on local host, there's no way I'm going to actually accomplish this without TPS lag. So I created a mod that basically mirrors what you would do on your server. So how this is working is you have something called a confirmation teleport packet. Now this is sent from the server to your client to confirm that you're being teleported. Now if the client never sends a packet back for confirming it, then the server kind of doesn't know what to do with you. It keeps you in two different locations. It gives you the same coordinate you teleported through a dimension as well as the coordinate you should be at. So if I went through this portal, it should uh, load uh, you know, 10K divided by eight. Uh, but it actually loads 10k divided by 8 and 10k, 10k in the nether. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to activate F3 and B, which just activates my mod, and it basically delays the confirmation teleport packet. So I'm going to simply just walk through this portal. As you're seeing, we're loading 80, 80k, 80k in the nether, and 10k, 10k in the overworld. Oh, excuse me, uh, 80k, 80k in the overworld, 10k, 10k in the nether. So I'm going to disable my mod, F3 and B, it a course root. And yeah, so it's very simple to get entity processing chunks from far away now. It's uh, as simple as walking through a portal and having, uh, you know, bad ping or TPS lag. It, it's literally it. I, unfortunately, I wish there was an easier way um, as this has to be done by a player. It cannot be done by an entity. Only a player entity is the uh, only way to do this. Anyway, so I'm going to demonstrate this live on the Psycraft test server. So I'll meet you guys over there. Hello guys, now I'm on the Psycraft 1.16.5 creative test server and I set up a portal at 20k 20k and I set up a detection system at 20k 20k in the nether to which if we do go through the portal it should uh, display entity processing chunks based on a entity processing detector with a command block and a minecart in it. Uh, so we're going to keep walking through the portal until eventually we display that we're loading 20k 20k in the nether. Come on, we should get it eventually. There we go. Yeah, as you can see, we got entity processing chunks at 20k, 20k, excuse at 200k in the nether. So that means we are entity processing. That means we can multiply our coordinates that we got in the overworld by eight. So if we really wanted to, we could build a portal at 20k, 20k, have an item go through, and now we're loading at 160k, 160k. So basically, if you have high MS and high TPS, uh, you can get remote chunk loading done more efficiently and easier. Uh, it's all about sending the confirmation packet. So if you can delay the confirmation packet for teleporting, then you can remote chunk load uh, your render distance at another location. But going through the portal, you're technically loading both locations. You're loading here as well as 20k, 20k until you send the confirmation packet. Uh, and just showing you, uh, using my mod I made, just pressing F3 and B just to hijack the same command, I should be able to entity process in seconds. Uh, using my mod. It's just delaying the confirmation packet. As you can see, easily entity process, disable it, eat a course route, and you are back to normal. So yeah, I'm gonna put the mod in the description just in case your server isn't laggy enough or you don't want to lag your server. If you still want entity process, uh, then yeah, you have that option. And it also does work in the opposite direction, like I said before. But yeah, anyways, hope you guys enjoy. 